Hello friends, I'm Hilary from Deco Boco Ego. It's so nice to see you again. I can hear a cicada. Summer in Japan. Today, I'm drawing. Do you like drawing? I do. I'm not very good at it, but that's okay. I like drawing and that's what matters. Here's a picture I drew of three friends. One happy friend, one angry friend, and one sleepy friend. Oh no, I forgot this friend's eyebrow. I better fix that. One second. There we go. Okay. The colour. I'm going to use these colouring pencils for the hair and the eyes and the clothes, but not for the skin. Skin is tricky, eh? Mm. A lot of people always use the same colouring pencil when they're colouring skin. They use this one. In fact, they use it so much that some friends even call this pencil Hadairo. Do you know the name of this colour in Japanese? That's right, it's Dai Dai Iro in Japanese. And in English, pale orange. It's a nice colour, but it's not Hadairo. Not my Hadairo, look. No. Is it your colour? Is it your friend's colour or your people at home? Actually, look carefully. Do you have exactly the same colour as your friends and your people at home? And think about your skin in the summer and then again in the winter. Is your skin the same all year round? Skin is amazing. There are so many different colours. My skin is peachy tan, but it's darker in the summer. This friend has pale tan skin. This friend has dark tan skin. This friend has brown skin. This friend has dark brown skin. This friend has ebony skin. This friend has pale ivory skin. Maybe where you live, you don't see too many different skin colors. But there are so many different skin colours in the world. It's a real waste to just use one pencil. Mm. You can use colouring pencils or crayons or markers, anything you like for your picture. But for today, I'm going to use some special pencils. These are called people colours. I use them in my classroom all the time. They're big and easy to use and so many browns and tans and on the side you can see the names of the colours. Like I said, there are lots of words for skin colour. Let's get started. For this friend I'm going to use this colour. It's called cinnamon. It's a red, brown, dark tan kind of colour. Can't forget to do the arms and the legs. All done. Next, for the dress and the bow, I'm going to use this colour. Do you know what it is? That's right. Pink! For the boots, I'm going to use this colour. What is it? That's right. Green. And now, for the hair. I'm going to use two colours and mix them together. Can you tell what they are? That's right, brown and red. Lastly, for the eyes, I'll use, that's right, green. And for the band-aid here, yes, pale orange. This friend, we're going to use this colour. It's called almond. It's a pale tan colour. For their tank top, I'm going to draw stripes with my ink pen. Do you know what colour this is? That's right. Black. And for the jeans? 
Yes, that's blue. Now for their hair, I'm going to use the yellow pencil. But when someone has yellow hair, we call it blonde. Blonde hair. And finally, for their eyes, I'm going to use the same colour as the jeans. Yes, blue. For our final friend, I'm going to use this colour. It's called gingerbread. It's a light brown, dark tan colour. For the dress, I'm going to use this colour. Do you know what it is? That's right, purple. And for the buttons, hmm, let's see. What colour is this? You know it, orange. Finally, for this friend's hair, I'm going to use what colour? That's right, black. And we're done. Now for the final touch. I'm going to use this stamp pad. Do you know what colour it is? Yes, red. I'm going to use this red stamp pad to make red cheeks. So using my finger as a stamp, we will go one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to add a couple of Z's to this friend here because they are very sleepy. Mm. And this friend looks angry, so I'm going to give her some blue angry marks. I think this friend is angry because this other friend did something naughty. So I'm going to give her an exclamation mark. A big green one, like her boots. And, uh, oh, I know. Perfect. Man, that looks really cool. I love all the different skin colours. I think they are beautiful. Mm. Before we say goodbye, let's practice all those colour words one more time. Pale orange. Pale orange. Peach. Peach. Tan. Tan. Brown. Brown. Ebony. Ebony. Ivory. Ivory. Pale. Pale. Dark. Dark. Good job! Well done! If you'd like to show me your pictures, please ask a grown-up to take a photo and you can send it to me at hillary at decobokoeguo.com I'll write it in the description for this video. And if you have questions or comments, you can contact me there too. Thanks for drawing with me today, friends. Please like this video and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you next time. Bye!